Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome to Journey to the Moon. Today is August 13th, 2017. Bitcoin is over $4,000 and rising with a total market cap over $135 billion for all-time highs. Some of the alts have taken a dip as it seems people are trending in their alts to ride the Bitcoin wave. Continuing with the Bitcoin bullish news, an article by Cointelegraph suggests that 80% of Chinese have never heard of Bitcoin. I would say 70 to 80% have never heard of Bitcoin before. With China having a population of 1.3 billion people, it's safe to say that a billion people have not heard of Bitcoin. Charlie Lee writes an article on Reddit saying that Litecoin is always silver to Bitcoin's gold. Bitcoin will always be the king. On his most recent tweet, Charlie Lee says that don't forget that Litecoin has already went through a 10x segwit price increase this year. Bitcoin has yet to 10x in price. On the bearish side of news, Chris defines Bitcoin bubble anytime Bitcoin doubles in a 30-day period, up 70% in the past 30 days. Along with a chart showing each time a Bitcoin crash crashed, yes, Bitcoin is up 70% in the past 30 days, but if you look at these crashes, I mean, Bitcoin was up 460%, 375%, 720%, and, and each of these events or crashes was was due to an event that caused caused a lot of FUD. As of right now, I mean, Bitcoin is pretty much everybody's happy with Bitcoin. I mean, the 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 hard fork wasn't as bad as people thought it was. And now that that's behind us, obviously you could see the way the market's reacting to the price of Bitcoin. Uh, but being that it is at all time highs. I would suggest uh, to take some profits. Here, uh, here's a video of uh, Trayvon James where he's uh, dumping some Bitcoin. Now, you could take that for for what you want, uh, but there are people that are that are thinking the same way as, hey, now is the time to uh, take some profits. I mean, obviously, we look at the daily chart here. I mean, it's all time highs. You don't really got to be an expert. Uh, wow, I mean, uh, four thousand four thousand one hundred and twenty on Bitstamp. Continuing to the weekly chart, I mean, yeah, you can see the pop here, uh, four thousand one hundred and twenty. I mean, if if you want to take some profits, I would suggest take some profits at all time highs as opposed to buying at all time highs, uh, especially if you bought in a couple of days ago, uh, under three thousand. <laughs> uh, it's crazy just just thinking about how how much Bitcoin has risen in the past couple of days. Uh, but if you don't need to sell, just keep uh, keep holding. You know, bullish news. It's all bullish. But speaking of the of the altcoins that have taken a hit, um, here's Neo up seventeen percent. OMG is down fourteen percent, as well as <clears throat> another I was looking at is a uh, Civic. Which is which ran up to like seventy cents a couple of days ago. So here's a video where I talked about a, a OMG on August 9th. and you could see I bought in at or I talked about buying in at before four dollars, and it ran up to like six dollars, six dollars to some change, and I took some profits. I did some swing trading, so you know I timed it pretty well. <clears throat> but ever since then. Uh, for the people that bought out top, they caught they wanted a bag holding. <clears throat> but for the most part, it looks like it's it's at a resistance here. Let's see which OMG is at right now. OMG sitting at you know five dollars and ninety cents. So if you're bag holding, uh, well, yeah, there it is, little green candle, right in time. Little green candle, uh, you know, it's pretty. It's pretty much the, you know, the support level here. So if you're back holding, you should expect to pump. Or if you're trying to, if you're looking for an entry, this would be a good entry uh, to come in with a uh, OMG. Uh, same thing with Civic. 
And I also said in the video, I was like, look, I don't chase. There it is. Just just like as I, I go into it, it pumps. I don't chase anything that goes over 100%. Once it goes over 100%, it, it, I, I won't. I, I'm not going to buy. And sure enough, it comes crashing down. Here's the support level. And here's the green candle to uh, support uh, the support level or to show the support level. So this would be a good uh, entry uh, for those. For if you're back holding, you know it's, it's coming up. It's hit support, and if you're looking for entry, uh, this would be a good time uh, to come in. But also in, in that video, I talked about how OMG it raised more mostly on the news versus actual uh, TA with the Vit Vitalik and the the plasma IO. It was more about a news pump that caused the initial raise in value <clears throat> but those two coins ha are at support levels for now and I do expect them to uh, start turning around especially with <clears throat> I mean Bitcoin is all-time high so people you know trading in their alts for to ride the Bitcoin wave and they're probably some people are gonna keep holding or they're now they're gonna look back to pick up some cheap coins <laughs> Yeah, to pick up some cheap coins now that they uh, increased their positions with uh, Bitcoin there. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think. Until then, I'll see you on the moon.